Hey YouTube, it's Alan here and welcome back to my channel. And today I, I am covering a little bit of news released by comicbook.com. Just recently, comicbook.com did an interview with Carl Lumberley. And if you don't know who he is, he's the actor who played Isaiah Bradley in Falcon and Winter Soldier Disney Plus show. Now, why is this interview important? Because in this interview, they asked him if he was willing to reprise his role as Isaiah Bradley in future installments in the MCU. And... Like what everybody always say whenever somebody always asks them that question about reprising their role in the MCU, they always answer it the same way. And that is, of course. Of course he is interested in reprising his role as Isaiah Bradley. Now to me, this is really cool because we can always go back into the flashbacks, right? And in flashbacks, we can have a little scene where you see Isaiah Bradley going toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Winter Soldier himself. Because again, during the war, Isaiah Bradley... And the Winter Soldier went head to head several times throughout the MCU, apparently, right? At least MCU history. And to me, that would be something really interesting to see because I always wondered how that fight played out. Because apparently, he took his arm off. Like, he took the Winter Soldier's arm off. So you know that it was really going in. And to me, I really want to see that be explored, to be dissected. Now, how would they do this? Hmm. If. For example, if Falcon was a soldier, was he at a season two? I would love to see that play out there. Um, if Sebastian Stan, Winter Soldier, gets his own spinoff himself, I would love to see that interaction take place as well. Now, another way they can do this is by his grandson, Elijah, or Eli Bradley, right? Eli Bradley, if you know him in the comic books, he played Patriot. And he was also shown in Falcon Winter Soldier as a kid. Now, one thing about the Patriot that we all should know or should know by now is he's a member of the new Avengers, which is what everybody is saying the MCU is trying to lead to. In this way, he can also be in, in a flashback or as a mentor role to young Elijah Bradley as he take his journey into becoming a hero. Now, will he be, you know, CGI and young and everything else? No, because as a mentor, he can stay as his current day self an old man doesn't need to be CGI, it just has to be a mentor position, right? And the last option that I have would be probably a standalone special, kind of like how the Black Widow was, where it's like a prequel. But in this case, Isaiah Bradley will be in that prequel. Now, that one is more unlikely to happen. The reason why is because of his age. Because of his age, yes, they can de-age him, but when it comes to playing these scenes out, it wouldn't flow naturally, considering he'll be completely CGI the entire time, right? Or, or what they can do is have Isaiah Bradley in current day retelling his story. So you have the older version of him, and then as he starts to retell his story, they have a flashback where they recast Isaiah Bradley as a younger actor, and have him play the movie out as Isaiah Bradley, right? And you can have voiceover moments where Carl himself will speak those roles. That's another way he can reprise his role in the MCU. And to me, all options are extremely great and extremely viable. And to be honest, I would really love to see this project come forward just to have another story to tell, just to have the MCU get more rounded, just so they can close in more Easter eggs and bring the MCU forward. Now, to me, I really enjoy each of these options I put forward, but I want to hear from you. I want to see which of these three options I've placed before you would be the best way for him to reprise his role as Isaiah Bradley. And with that said, do the three great things, which is like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.